Somebody is always calling this house. Dang. <clears throat> Hello, Mrs. Collins speaking. Hi, this is Rachel Anderson, your next door neighbor. Oh, Rachel. Hi, we spoke the other day. How's everything? How can I help you? Well, my kid's babysitter canceled at the last minute. Oh, I no. was wondering if your son could babysit my eight-year-old twins, Ben and Mia, tonight? Oh. It would be from about 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. Well, honestly, Leo hasn't had much babysitting experience. He probably is the one that needs a babysitter himself, matter of fact. Oh, that's okay. Mia and Ben are pretty easygoing. I have a clear list of instructions that he can follow as well. Well, okay, that doesn't sound too bad. You know what? I'm sure he would love to. Oh, really? That would be great. Thanks, bye. bye! Mom, do I really have to? Yes, you really have to. It's going to be easy. And it's about time you do something nice for somebody besides yourself. Plus, she recently got divorced. Those poor kids probably need someone fun like you to spend some time with them. You're going over there at 7. Okay, fine. As long as I get paid. I, I do get paid, right? Yes, Miss Anderson will pay you. Now go get ready. Coming. I cannot believe mom is making me do this. Hi, you must be Leo. Come on in. Yeah, that's me. Thanks. Thank you so much for helping me out. All you have to do is warm up the food in the fridge. It's marked with today's date and the kids love it. They'll probably want to play with you, but they need to brush their teeth before bedtime, which is 8.30. Ben needs to read before bed. There's money if you need anything. Don't worry, Miss Anderson. I got it. Trust me. Well, I better get going. Call me if you need anything, okay? Oh, my keys. I'd lose my head if it wasn't attached. <laughs> Bye. Be good, kids. Bye, Mom. Bye, Mommy. Okay, well, uh, hi, Ben. Hi, Mia. My name is Leo. That's nice, but I don't think we need a babysitter. I know how to take care of me and my sister. You don't even know how to use the stove. Hey, you weren't supposed to tell him that, Mia. Look, I don't even want to be here. My mom made me do this thing, so let's just act like we had a good time. Now, your mom did say something about your favorite food being in the fridge, so let's just see what that is. Ugh, meatloaf. Ew, we are not eating that. Yeah, our mom doesn't know how to cook. How about we order pizza? Did you just- oh my goodness. Yeah, pizza, pizza, pizza. Alright, well, your mom did leave some money for us, so I guess that's fine. Bro, are they even open right now? Hi, can we get a- Extra, extra large pepperoni pizza. No, Ben. I want cheese. Mia, you can just pick off the pepperoni, alright? Fine. Just one large pepperoni pizza, please. Hey, you ordered a large pepperoni pizza? Yep. Let me just get the cash real quick. Alright. Here you go, my guy. Keep the change. There is no change, idiot. Bye! Nah, 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 nah. You must have given me the slow car or something. There is no way you are beating me by this much. I promise I didn't. <laughs> Leo, do you think you can play dress up with me? No, because he's playing race cars with me, Mia. Don't worry, don't worry. I can make some time for the both of you. So you want me to dress up as? I can do a really good superhero. Well, no. Just close your eyes. I have something else in mind. <laughs> Come on, hurry up. Ow, my eye. Girl, what is you doing to me? You got like five seconds left. She was a fairy. Oh, <laughs> nah, Mia, you gotta be kidding me. What in the world did you do? Haha, -ha, I told you that you would look beautiful. I'm sure Sarah would love to see you dressed up like this. Hey, yo, 
Yo, how do you know Sarah? You got a text from her while you were getting all pretty. And she called you Prince Charming. <laughs> More like princess. All right, look, we are never, ever in our lives telling anybody about this. This is ridiculous. I cannot wait to go home. Matter of fact, it's 7.45. Y'all should probably start getting ready for bed. Yeah, maybe if you can catch us. Hey, hey, get back here. Come on, stop running. I'm tired. Don't make me call your mom. I'll admit, you are fast. Finally, got you. Oh, man. Ugh, I didn't think you could catch both of us that quickly. <laughs> Don't underestimate me. Now, while you guys get ready, I need to clean this horrifying mess up. Okay. Okay. Man, I thought I came here to babysit, not be a flipping maid. Good night, Mia. Okay, buddy. Her mom will be home soon. She just called. So you are going to have to quit your shift at the pizza place. Don't forget, you got to read too. Fine. My book is right here. All right. Well, after you read, make sure you go to bed, all right? Wait. Huh? What's up? Could you, um, maybe check the closet to make sure there's no monsters in there? <laughs> monsters? Come on, man. It's not funny, Leo. Just go look, please. All right, all right, fine. Let me see. Mm, I don't see anything over here. Good. Oh, wait. Take one of these. Ah, oh, dang, I finally relax. Hello, Leo? Oh yeah, Ben, you good? Yep, I just wanted to say thanks for being the best babysitter. Sorry if we were a little bad. Don't worry about it, you remind me of when I was little. Now pretend you're asleep, your mama's home. Oh shoot! Finally back home. Welcome back. Did everything like you asked me to. Kids are in bed. So how did- Whoa! Always something on the ground. Well, the house looks good. As promised, here's your $45. Thanks again, Leo. See you around. A bed. Never broke. Leo is back. Let's go. Not gonna take Sarah out one of these days. Oh, uh, <clears throat> see you around, Miss Anderson. Hey, 